If you're looking for a neighborhood where you can live, work, and play in one of the best Dallas suburbs, you'll want to check out our tour on Lakeside. So stay tuned. We're Brett and Molly Chance of Texas Home Life Realty, and we love helping people find the right Dallas suburb to live in. Now, as we take you on this tour of Lakeside, be sure and drop your comments below. Tell us what you think about this place. And stay tuned to the end when we talk all about what the home prices are in the area. So let's go take a look. Lakeside is a live, work, and play community. And it's located on 150 acres right at Lake Grapevine in Flower Mound, Texas. Now, Lakeside is located about 10 minutes away from Dallas-Fort Worth International Airport, which is really convenient for those who are having to do a lot of travel for work. Now, it's also about a 30-minute drive to downtown Dallas or 30-minute drive to downtown Fort Worth if you're having to commute to the, either location. And of course, you're literally right there at Lake Grapevine. So if you like an active lifestyle, you're right there for all of the great parks and trails in the lake itself. Now there definitely are quite a few shops and restaurants located right there in Lakeside. So now we're gonna break it down what it's really like to live, work, and play in Lakeside. So let's start with the work. Whether you're looking to work in the Lakeside community or you're just looking to be able to do your business and your shopping closer to home, you do have some choices. Lakeside currently features a florist shop, a cycle shop for those bikers, a boutique, a small grocery store, and then there are quite a few health, beauty shops, salons, a fitness center, dry cleaners, a pack and ship for your mailing needs, and then real estate and insurance offices as well. Now let's talk about play in Lakeside. But first, tell us, are you an indoor person? Or are you more of an outdoor person? Tell us in the comments below if you'd like to live in a place where you can be active outdoors or not. For families or even outdoor enthusiasts, there are a lot of things to do in and around the Lakeside community. Within walking distance, Lake Grapevine offers a lot of things to do like boating, kayaking, swimming, and fishing. You can get a beautiful view of the lake right there at the boardwalk at Sunset Point. Now it's a 6,000 square foot patio or deck area where it's got the seating and beautiful landscaping. And for those who have fur babies, there's also a great dog park there as well. Now, there's also miles of hiking and biking trails between Lakeside Trail and North Shore Trail, which actually borders Lake Grapevine. For those of you that are more about the indoor entertainment, there is a movie house and eatery located in Lakeside. And if you have an addiction to coffee, there is a Starbucks there as well. And there is no lack of great places to either just grab a snack or sit down for a great dining experience. Now, we love going to Lakeside uh, for a night out, whether it's a family night out or a date night out. There is a good mix of dining options for both. Now, we do have several favorite spots like 1845 Taste of Texas, which is owned by Marty B., which has several different restaurants in the area as well as done very successful with those. The food and atmosphere here is amazing. And also, if you want a great steak, that is a place to go. And then on the weekends, they also have a great patio where they have live music, as long as weather is permitting. Another one of our favorites is Mina's Tex-Mex Grill and Cantina. This is not your typical Tex-Mex food. They have a great menu, great dining experience. They even have a patio as well. And another great place, which is a little bit more casual, is the tavern. Now, it really kind of took us by surprise because we figured they'd be serving just ordinary, you know, bar and grill food. That is definitely not the case. They have, a, you know, definitely a great menu as well as an outdoor seating area and also a little area to be able to play cornhole just to be able to have some fun uh, with friends and family. For something a little more fancy, there is Mianano Trattoria, which is Italian fare and fine wines. Now, they also have outdoor dining with views of the Grassy Plaza, where they have the Lakeside Music Series outside in the summertime between about early April to late November. One of our favorite places to go for lunch is Craft Pie Pizzas. This is definitely not your normal uh, pizzeria because you've got unlimited options for your pizza, so you definitely make it the way that you want it. Now, it is a, a fast, casual place, so it's a great place to grab something to eat and go. 
There are several other eateries, everything from breakfast food to desserts to even a wine bar. Now let's change gears into what it's like to live in Lakeside. Now there's definitely quite a variety of housing in Lakeside, from apartments to luxury condos, luxury villas, to single family homes. So how would you like to live like you're at a resort every day? The luxury condos at Lakeside Tower offer resort style living with valet parking, 24 seven concierge, on-site spa, a private dining and wine room, a whiskey bar, movie room, gym and locker and steam rooms, simulated golf, heated light pool, a pool bar, a putting green, outdoor dining, and fire pits. Now, depending on the level, these units are currently selling for anywhere from 1 million up to over 3 million. The villas or the townhomes have access to all the amenities that Lakeside Tower has. Now, they're all selling for around a million dollars. Now, the single family homes are custom built homes built on fairly small lots. However, they do offer great living spaces. Now, these homes are starting off selling around 500,000 all the way up into the million range. Now, for the kiddos that live in Lakeside, Louisville ISD currently serves the area. So you have Blue Bonnet Elementary, Shadow Ridge Middle, and Flower Mound High Schools. All properties in Lakeside, obviously except for the apartments, are within an HOA and the fees for those will vary depending on the type of property. Now to get a better idea of what these properties look like on the inside, click on our link below in the description. And if you're thinking about making a move to Flower Mound, grab our Flower Mound relocation guide below as well. Otherwise, check out one of our next videos on another great Flower Mound neighborhood.